Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Sniper, back in another video. So, yeah, today I'm going to be talking about what's going to be coming in our show and what is going on in our show right now. So, before we get started, please subscribe and help me, uh, help me out a lot. And if you could like the video, it would be really cool. And join the Sniper fam. So, what's well, going to be coming in our show? Let's talk about it. So, what's going to be happening is, um, on uh, January um, 12th or something, Midnight Crystal, um, uh, uh, she is an Arsenal developer, uh, she posted this on Discord. She said, uh, the, there's a new graffiti event coming, hopefully after Exone's quest event. So, you guys might be thinking, graffiti event? What is this, Sniper? How are we gonna get this? What is gonna be happening in the event? And how do we unlock the stuff which is gonna come? Well, I'll get into that first in a second, but I want to explain something um, before I talk about that. So, in the graffiti event, you could be able to uh, obtain two bundles. So, it's uh, a rabble roster and a delinquent. Rabble Rouser and Delinquent Skins. So you guys will be able to obtain a Rabble Rouser and Delinquent Skins. So, it'll not be like only the skins I'm supposing. It'll be bundle. It'll be a whole bundle, like the Bishop of Time. If you guys didn't see my video from December. Basically, um, you could have got a Calling Card. A Kill Effect. A Weapon Skin. And a Skin. And a Melee. So, yeah. That's what came with the bundle. And with the Arbiter bundle as well. So, the same thing. It all came with that. So, I'm supposing in the Rabble Roster and Delinquent um, bundle, we're going to get same like that. But, like, different, of course. Different skins. So, that's what's going to be coming. So, now, let's talk how are we going to obtain the skins. So, he ex she explained, sorry. She explained that you're going to be picking two teams. Um which you have to get kills I'm supposing so you have to ch uh, choose one team and then you have to get kills I'm supposing that I'm not sure about it and then you have to get kills to win your team means to get your team to win it's basically like if you flick off mobile there's an there's an event you need to get more kills from your team it's basically you have to get uh, kills for uh, one of your more of your teams, and then you will get collect rewards for like times you kill, so things like levels in the event. So in the event, you'll be able to kill people. That's a bad word, isn't it? So you'll be able to oof people, and then when you done that, you would uh, be able to um when you done that. You'll be able to um, get more points for your team, and then in the end of the event, I'm supposing event, I'm supposing the rewards will be given out for the most kill, kills team. So that's only what I'm supposing. I'm not uh, confirmed. We've not confirmed it yet. Um, that's only what I'm supposing. I'm thinking, and yeah, and then the second thing which I was talking about. When is this going to be coming? So Exone. Uh, you know the Exone, he's also a developer, he's a moderator or developer, and you might know him. So, Midnight Crystal told right, and she saw, she said um, that it would come hopefully after Exone's quest event. So, if she do, if you don't know what quest event she's talking about, it's the, the Knight's Edge event melee. So, that Knight's Edge melee event, the, after that's over, we're probably uh, hoping for the graffiti event. So that's what Midnight Crystal said. We're not sure about it. Again, I'm saying that. So then once that's done, yeah, I think we're going to be getting more events. Arsenal's actually blowing up with events. So it's a really good um, right now. So it's having a lot of players right now. 26k every day, something. And now let's move on to the next thing which will be coming. So... Um, soon there's gonna be summer, so there's gonna be a summer three update. I don't know when, uh, when it's gonna be coming, but yeah, of course there's gonna be a summer three event. There's, it's not gonna be like no summer three event. So in the summer three event, it's just like last year. You'll be able to unlock cases, 
and then there was also a spin in the wheel so in the spinning wheel it was literally a summer care package it says so in the summer care package you could have got some skins i will show them up, show them up on the screen right now so the skins you were able to get the skins you were able to get was let me find it okay um let's see let's see the skins were one was um was that yeah so one of them the skins you could have got from the spinning wheel was the normal human so that's basically a sand skin i suppose so one of them you could have got the normal human skin from the spinning wheel and you could have got a nothing news caster uh, you could have also got that i got unusuals for all of them um and then you could have also got the neve skin that's this is all from the spinning wheels i'm trying then octaya skin and then after that we could have gotten the sarah skin so the sarah skin is a rare it's like collector's article i got unusual for that and yeah that's the ones which i got and there's all there was also cg i don't know siege siege i don't know how to pronounce that and you could have also got taylor and you could have also got um rat. oh wait no that's from the halloween event and you could have got xavier so this all this was that event was really cool and that event was really cool and it was fun and what else was there was there was crates over here so it's basically last year was costing 24 2 wait what yeah it was costing 2.4k just like like two character crates so it costed 2.4k and then when um, you bought one you could have got the brick battle um some other skins i'm supposing and some melees which is the big sip and the development pop so you could have got the delinquent pop and the big sip fun fact the delinquent pop used to look like the the i don't know the melee melee so yeah and we're hoping on the next one on let's move on to the next one we're actually hoping the dev melee night of edge event this is the last one so we're hoping the night edge melee event stage five i'm guessing so the alternate code there's an alternate code you have to put in the void so how you do this event i have a whole video on it but i have not done the event myself so sorry about that because i am scared because when i see i hear music i just all f4 so i i'm not doing the event i've tried it once it's not working so I have I have made a tutorial on how to get to the second room to un unlock the key on uh, to put the number on the keypad. So you just need to put that just to get Dave Millie. So yeah. And then then after that when you have the Moy and all that you need step three, um, that's all. And then when you're done you have to you have to go on another game called Isle and then you have to get the badge called the facility. When you're done that, you have to. There will be a door unlocked on the edge, night's edge event. You just have to activate the event. And there will be a door. And then when that door is opened, there's the void. So if you guys are wondering what is the green cube or blue cube, I don't know what's that color. So if you're wondering what cube that is, that's the spawn point. That's the spawn point. That every game uses it basically where you spawn and yeah so and then there's a keypad so you have to un uh, i'm supposed you have to put the codes in keypad and then when you're done that you have to you can get the maybe so it'll just say help or something on the keypad which you unlock in the whole event where you have to go to the maze and all so that's all i know Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.